I was always getting into something as a kid, trying to finger paint on the refrigerator. This is the fun part of my job is I get to just kind of be a kid and make a mess on the back of my truck. My name is Trey Valentine and I'm from Reno, Nevada. I am a window cartoonist. I paint signs on windows. I um, paint windows for any and all occasions. Lots of restaurants, tire places, car dealerships. I've done flower shops. You name it, I've done it. My best signs usually turn out when they go, just do whatever. <laughs> Those usually turn out really well because I have no boundaries and I can get real creative. I take a crayon and just kind of get like an idea of what I want to put on there. Um, if it was warmer, I would do it with a paintbrush, but it'll take too long to dry. <laughs> so I'll just do it in crayon and then I'll come back with my paint and I'll start painting it. And then with my fingernail, I'll etch out where my reference lines are and you'll get kind of a, a weird uh, silhouette looking thing on the window. And then I can go from there. This is a gymnasium that I'm painting today, and the client wanted all the characters to be in shape. So I put a weight in this guy's hand and uh, gave him a little bit of muscle tone. She said she wanted a really fit Santa, so I'm gonna make them all buff. I always do the white because the, the paint, if you just put um, colors on here, you kind of see right through it, and it wouldn't look really good. This kind of attaches the color to the window, gives it that nice opaque awesomeness. So most of my characters get a white outline around them to really make them jump off the window. So you see how I've kind of like left a little bit of white. I'll do a black outline inside the white. So there'll be a definite edge to him and then like a little aura around him which will make him really pop off the window. When I first started doing this, everything was just one color. Like, I didn't do any highlights or shadows or any, anything. And within the last couple years, I really started to dig the whole highlights and shadows and different colors. Very subtle difference, but there's definitely a difference. I like signs like these because they're just quick, they're fun, they're easy. You don't have to really measure anything. Just kind of go for it. My favorite part about painting signs on windows is the fact that it's an instant gratification. I get an idea in my head, it goes on the window pretty quickly, and I get to see it come to fruition or I see it come to life within the afternoon. I've been doing this my whole life. I was a uh, musician back in the day, back in the 80s, and I'd go out and play clubs all night. No one made money back in the 80s being a musician. So uh, I'd go out, I learned how to paint window signs, and then after a while, I learned how to do it right. I did the office thing, you know, I was in radio for a little while, and that's all indoors. And right now it's a little tough because it's 22 degrees outside and I can't feel my fingers all the time, and I get home and I'm pretty worn out um, just from the weather. But the other side of that coin is in the summertime, I'm running around in a tank top and shorts, working on my tan and having a blast, listening to music and painting signs.